Uh, hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Loki, and I'm back with some Dragalia loss. How did I forget to get one moment? Never mind, we good. Um, <laughs> I'm here with some Dragalia lost. The game is shutting down. We all know this. I know this. You know this. There's no hiding it. I'm gonna keep on playing the game, and I'm gonna. I've decided that I'm gonna start releasing as many videos as I can until the time comes where it's all said and done. And I'm gonna try doing it with every single unit if I can. He's like 200 something um, characters, so there's no way in hell I'll be able to get him there. But I'm gonna try and focus on the ones that at least mean a lot to me or have a fun story to them. And for the first one, this is a unit I've been meaning to do a redone on something for a long time. It's Mega Man. Technically, our second collab character that we ever got. Probably, yes, I'm gonna say right now, the most rare um, unit in the entirety of Dragalia Lost, because he only showed up once. And that was it. I think the only other characters you could consider on his tier of extremely rare are the Persona characters and the Monster Hunter characters. And that's about it. But I would say Mega Man's one step above him because he's bad. In this game, they've made my boy Mega Man so bad. And I was so hyped for him. You can go back to those videos where it's just me like hyping him up going, Oh my god, Mega Man, could we get Quick Man? Could we get Wood Man? Is my boy Wood Man gonna make it? No, he, he didn't make it. They made an awesome print with him for sure. They, there's some amazing print art for Mega Man. Um, uh, and also some rocking music, which I'm gonna show up, which is the best part about Mega Man is the music they made for the Mega Man event. Some of the greatest event ever. But the Mega Man event was very bad. Mega Man is bad. He's built bad. He's built stupid. He's built everything bad. I'm gonna use him and I'm gonna try to articulate why I've always thought he's bad. The, the reason I keep saying that he's bad and I'm harping on it so much, I love Mega Man. I also like him. I love him because there's a dedicated group in Dragalia who are Mega Man mains. Who love Mega Man, know he's bad, and they still try and do stuff with him. And I think that is glorious. I welcome that type of play, and I love that type of play. I'm going to go in here with Wolf. I'm going to die. Yeah, sure, let's do this master. I'm pretty sure my other three characters could easily carry Mega Man to the end. <laughs> uh, let's go. Um, but yeah, funny enough, maybe you, um, up until I think the people video and the guide video, funny enough... Mega Man was my most disliked video for a very long time because I was right out the gate saying the, the Mega Man is bad. They have done terrible to this character. So this is actually something they have improved since his original release. In the beginning, you could not actually run and force strike. And um, that was just something you couldn't do in the game. And it wasn't until they introduced Hunter Cerise was that something like literally the next collab unit after everyone after I was kept saying and I think a lot of people were saying like how come Mega Man doesn't like um uh why is his everything so bad and it's like well I guess they couldn't replicate the thing he can do in the game so you know you do with what you can um, the problem was is that literally the next Capcom character the next collab character literally did exactly what Mega Man did. But better, not that he did. It was he. Uh, Hunter Cerise was what Mega Man should have been all along. Uh, uh, but the cool thing is that he does get Rush. So I was always very vocal about how I did not like him up front. Um, I was extremely disappointed because Mega Man, in my eyes, had if he was going to be the only character from the collab, he should have been absolutely snapped. They should have made this man 27 different ways, busted, broken, and they didn't. They made him so bad. That I kind of actually believe the conspiracy theory that Lurp had, which was that Mega Man was a forced collab on them. That's why Monster Hunter was so good and Mega Man was just so terrible. Like, that's the only reason in my mind I can think of why they made him this way. And the reason he's also kind of bad is that the it, it really ties into his skills here. Funny enough, this like interesting like mechanic that he has right here with the the bubble shield, uh, not the bubble, with the shields and stuff. Oh god, let me get out of the way. In a lot of ways, he has a lot of interesting mechanics that would be later used on characters that just did what he did but better. So that's why I was always like hoping that when he got a mana spiral, they would do a full like um, rehash of Mega Man and just make him what he was supposed to be. In my eyes, the perfect character because really. He has two of the most like busted skills from Mega Man 2. He has the 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 Metal Blades, which are if you don't know this, Metal Blades is like the best um, Mega Man weapon in Mega Man 2 because it deals super effective damage to basically everyone. 
Like, it, the thing that has literally no weakness to anything, because it just constantly just deals damage. Um, and Leaf Shield is just very nice to have. I don't think it's actually the one of the better ones, but Leaf Shield is kind of nice. I like using it. It's very nice for some added um, stuff in there. But, um, yeah, so they gave him the right moves. It's just that he's so undeniably bad. And it's funny, too, because I think if they had waited a little bit later, he could have been a mana caster. <laughs> because making him the um, the skill, uh, the, the class with the edge, which I think he's a wand unit, it just doesn't make any sense. So like I said, like eventually they would keep releasing units like uh, units with guns that just make, would make sense for what Mega Man wants to do. Um, and I would always hope that they would eventually one day do right by Mega Man, but we ain't letting that happen. Right now he's beating Nasso, and by him I mean my other good characters are carrying him to a Volk victory. <laughs> it's gonna be really funny if this ends up being my um... That's the other thing you just saw there as I got hit, is that you can't actually um... You can't uh... Oh, uh, there we go. But yeah, they definitely did a little bit to him. Like, look, 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 they spent like so much time on like cool little slide animation here doesn't speak. Mega Man has no words. He has nothing to say to you. Or to me, honestly. Which is fine. Hello, Mega Man. Sure, I'll take this weekly bonus. Who cares? But yeah, Mega Man has always had a very, like, I've had a very love-hate relationship with him. It always felt like he was kind of lazy, but the stuff they did around it, like this art, for example, is fucking sick. Look at this. This is some amazing art right here for him and then his 3d form fantastic that's straight up just Mega Man he translates well and then look at him he is a little brush jet amazing lovely so um here's the other thing I wanted to show uh so let me put this off here's the best thing that come from the Mega Man collab IMHO in my honest opinion it is the music that came from it because it is some of the ugh, the Mega Man 2 music is some of the best in the world. Um, Andrew Galia has made some amazing songs, but just listen to this. Oh, shit. This is from Dr. Wiley Stage, their remix of it. Yeah, just kind of. You can't see me, but I am dancing to the music. It just goes so fucking hard for no reason. <laughs> yes, strut to the song. Alright, let me go to the next one. That was only one song. I think they did another one. Let me see. I think they did the stage select. Yeah. Pretty good remix of the stage select from Mega Man. Which is just, again, a stage select song. <laughs> oh, this is my favorite. Um, let me see. I think this one might actually be the final one. No, is this boss battle one? Let me see. Yeah, this is just a boss battle song. Yeah, this is the boss battle theme from Mega Man. Cause that's the, the that's the song that plays when you go in there. So yeah, they had I think one other song on here. Uh, and all the music is in this. I need to appre you need to appreciate this music with me <laughs> just for a bit. And I think we'll end it on this one. Oh, no, actually, damn it. Um, I'm gonna pause. I'll be right back. Alright, this is how I'm going to end it off. Thank you, shoutouts to Game Explained for having the intro up. Um, the, I tried to look for it in the event compendium, but it didn't have. This was the intro to the Mega Man event. And I want you to, again, be a Mega Man fan. Imagine seeing this and imagine how hype it was. And I'm going to end it on that. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out. Alright, I'm an idiot and I forgot that some other parts of the side of the screen are showing. I'm just gonna play it now. Alright, here it is.
gonna leave now. Peace out. <laughs>